In this question we are graphically solving a system of linear equations. So we have two linear equations. I'm going to start with the first one and it is in the form y equals mx plus b and in this form we can see that m is one-third and the b is a minus one. So using those two pieces of information I'm going to start with the b which is the y-intercept of minus one so on the y-axis, I'm going to go down to minus 1 and put our first point. And then from that point, the slope here, 1 third, is rise over run. So that means we're going to go up 1 and then over 3. And we could continue from each point by going up 1 and over 3. And those dots will form a line. The second equation is in a different format. So for this one, it's actually easier for us to find the x and y intercepts. So for the x intercept, we know the y value is going to be zero. And then for the y intercept, the x value will be zero. So we just need to find these two points and we can connect them to form the line. So starting with the first one, where y is equal to zero, if I replace y with zero, I would have 2x plus zero equals six. So 2x equals six, and solving for the x by dividing two on each side, we have x equals three. So that coordinate is three zero, and then to find the y-intercept, the second point, we let x equal 0. So this time x is 0. We would have 2 times 0 plus y equals 6, doing the substitution up here. So 2 times 0 is 0. This is just y equals 6. So the second point is 0, 6. So graphing each one of these, the first point, 3, 0, we would go to the right 3 and 0. And then the second point, 0, 6, we start at the origin, 0, and then go up 6. So with those two points, we would connect them to make the second line. And since we're looking for the solution, the solution is where the two lines cross. And in this case, it's at this point right here, and that point is at 3, 0. One thing to notice, although we found our solution here as a single point, there might be a situation where there is no solution, where your two lines are parallel, or there could be a situation where there are infinitely many solutions where your two lines are on top of each other. 